These are great pumps for a lot of reasons. The Grundfos SQ. They often get confused with the SQE, which is a constant pressure pump, which is pretty awesome too, but it has a separate controller and a transducer is required. Uh, with this pump, this is kind of uh, simpler in that it doesn't need a controller. It's a two-wire pump and a couple features about it is soft start. So these again complement a solar type system greatly um, because they're not going to beat up your battery or your inverter. They have dry run protection built in so if you have a low producing well they will protect themselves. You don't need to add any other controllers to it. Pretty easy to install. Um, there's a full range of these SQ pumps and they'll pump from half five gallons a minute up to 30 gallons a minute. So really nice centrifugal pump. It's not a rotor style, it's a centrifugal pump. This one is a 10 SQ uh, 200 and uh, it's uh, just a three quarter horse. So let me show you the the tag on this one. Well, it doesn't really say, but yeah, the 10 SQ 7 200. So the 7 is the three quarter horse, 10 gallons a minute. And uh, so the total dynamic head is is fine on this one. This is a this well. Here's our well. It's um, I think a 50 static water level, and uh, it's about 300 foot deep, and it's got a really good yield on it. I can't remember exactly. I think it's 12 gallons a minute, and uh, this one's actually 15 gallons a minute. So yeah, we fortunate in this uh, at this place. There's a lot of houses being built, and so we're putting in a lot of pumps. So these are kind of fun, but I wanted to really, you know, if you need a pump or you're replacing a pump or you're going solar, a lot of reasons to get this pump, especially the soft start capability. Uh, it's just a well-made, good company. We've enjoyed them. They just do the job. Plus, they're so small, three inches in diameter. I've been able to add them to existing wells if, to put multiple pumps in. It's real easy to do with this pump. It's only three foot long, three inches in diameter. So it has a lot of functionality. You can get them in 115 volt also if you want to run them off a little little inverter generator. You can do that, um, or any small 120 volt output generator or inverter. So there's a lot of uses. If you need help, let us know, and uh, there'll be links in the description. Just check out our website, practicalpreppers.com, and uh, click on water, and it'll take you to these SQ pumps. Also, if you want to just give me, you can email me your well specs and we can get you the right pump for the job. Again, it's info at practicalpreppers.com. All right, folks, let's get to work.